Boom. Ooh. That's bright. That is super bright. It's just too dark out here right now with this light. But you can hear them. Rod is bent. That's a big old shark. Vroom, vroom. I am your father. What's up guys, Brian the CEO here. Welcome to another edition of CEO Fishing. Today I'm gonna test a green LED light. I got it on Amazon. It's a 25 inch LED that emits green light. Supposedly it puts out about 10,000 lumens. So here it is, you know, it's you know basically a waterproof tube. I actually added some extra silicone just to make sure because some of the reviews said that water leaked in. So to avoid any of that, I went ahead and added some additional silicone around the, the um, connectors. Basically it runs off of either the battery because it comes with clips or a 12 volt which I happen to have right here. So let me give it a little test. Plug it in. Boom. Oh right there. Look at that. Ooh. Vroom, vroom. I am your father. On a serious note, you know, I love dock light fishing. There's always some snook or you know an occasional tarpon and stuff, snapper, and there's all kinds of fish that are attracted to these lights. The smaller fish, the bait fish, come to the light like like zombies, like Ooh. the bigger fish, the game fish, they come to eat the bait fish that like the green light. I'm gonna drop this in the water. I'm about two or three feet of water, so it's not very deep, but that doesn't matter. There's a bunch of mangroves right here. There should be a lot of bait fish that come off of there that come out here. And uh, hopefully I can get tied on something bigger than just some bait fish. I'm gonna try and get some underwater for you guys. We'll see what happens. But at the end of the day, as usual, I'm still fishing. And that's all that matters. Still waiting on the sun to go down. Got here a little earlier than I thought, but it is time to get into that night mode. So I'm gonna flick on the lights real quick. And uh, yeah, probably about 10, 15 more minutes. They'll be down low enough and I'm gonna drop in the light. I'll show you guys the whole process and uh, fingers crossed that I'm in a good spot where I can catch some fish. If I catch a barracuda, you know I'm gonna throw out and try and catch a shark. So that's just a given. Stay tuned, guys, I really hope you enjoy. If you do enjoy the channel, guys, make sure you hit the subscribe button and hit the notification bell to stay in tune with all the videos that I got coming up. I'm gonna be doing some interviews with different anglers and stuff and uh, going out and fishing with them. No competition on my end. Don't care what people say, you know. I'm just living my life, enjoying it. And uh, I just wanna share that with people. So I, I hope you enjoy. And again, I appreciate all of you guys. But stay tuned, cause hopefully I got some action coming. That's the baby. Still got some sunlight. Patience, patience, patience. That's fishing, patience. The sun is down behind the trees. It's getting a little bit darker, so I'm gonna kinda get it all set up before it's completely pitch black out here. I mean, I do got my little running lights here, but that's really not that much lighting. So let's go ahead and light this bad boy up, dip it in the water, and uh, let this process start. Plug it in, plug it in. Boom, ooh, that's bright. That is super bright. All right, so what I'm gonna try to do is drop it off the back here. Um, probably just gonna tie it off. Tie it off right here. So let's let this go down in the water. Boom, right there, looks good. Let's wrap it. Just like that. I think we're good to go. I got some green light behind the boat. Let's see what happens. Nobody ever accused me of being smart. I totally forgot my lights for nighttime filming. So I'm gonna do the best that I can. Hopefully I get to show you some action, but uh, sucks, I, have to, might, I might have to come out and do it again another night. I will always figure something out. Even if I have to use my phone. Something hit. Don't know what hit. Something hit the line though. 
top of this right here. There we go. Hopefully you guys can see me. It's already pulled out a lot of drag and it's got a lot of shake to it. Whatever it was, it hit hard and it hit fast. There we go. So, waiting for the green light to kick in, the little bait fish to come, you know, it's kind of barracuda. Threw it on the line here. Just to kill some time, you know, I might as well let some bait sit out there, catch something big. The bottom of my rod came off the, the little padding down there, so it's destroying my crotch right now. Bruh. Nice. Let's see if I can get some light in the water here. Oh, he's still pulling drag. There you go, guys. If you can actually see him, it's a big shark. Woo! Back this way, buddy. Gotta work him. Gotta work him. I'd like to get a nice, clean shot of this for you guys. Let me stop this. I gotta figure out how to get him on board. All right. I'm still trying to fight this thing. <sighs> Try to get some angles in the water, but it's just too dark out here right now with this light. You can hear him. Rod is bent still. I gotta try and wear him out because uh, I want to get him de hooked. But he's big. Personal best big for a lemon shark. I think that's what it is. Got it on his belly right now. I gotta get the hook out. But let me wipe off the screen. But yeah, that's a big old shark right there let me get this hook out and then i'll flip them and uh let you check them out there it is guys i think it takes up the whole boat and then some ah. beautiful shark fought forever i couldn't get it in just because he's a little too big for me to land by myself but i still managed to get him on board so i can get the hook out That's a nice shark. That is the last time I'm gonna land a shark that big by myself at night. That was too much. Uh, could barely get the hook out, but the main part, like every time I tried to grab him, he took off again. And that was a good, another 10 minutes of uh, just that. Uh, so got him back in the water, swam off. But, whoo, I'm tired. I didn't even get to check my uh, light. I'm sure whatever was sitting here in that green light is not there anymore. So uh, I'll probably have to try and test out another night from whatever you guys could actually see. I hope you enjoyed the episode. You know, uh, we'll actually get the final review on that green light later. Um, there were some little fish swimming around, but by the time, you know, there was any decent sized bait fish coming around, that shark crushed the freaking line and uh i'm too tired my girlfriend's mad at me because i'm still out in the boat it's like 10 something at night so i'm gonna pack it up go home take a shower and uh try and get some sleep got my daughter's birthday party this weekend so uh, gotta get ready for that so guys hope you enjoyed again hit that subscribe button smash that notification bell and go ahead and give this video a thumbs up if you like what you see and uh, i promise i'll get back out here i'll check i'll, I'll test that green light and uh, see where it goes from there. Guys, see you next time. Tight lines.
the passion. They say I be swagging, they slaying in fashion. Feel like King Arthur, I just laid a dragon. My jig on the bottom, I ain't even snagging. Slay like a savage, so slick in the best.